Welcome back guys, it's your boy Scooby Stacks. Today we're going to start the new episode of Tell from Borderlands, episode 3. I've been waiting for this for a little while. It came, finally came out. It came out like a couple of days ago. So I'm going to start that. Sorry I didn't throw it up the first day. It didn't come out. I've been like uploading and then I've been starting on twitching too. So you guys can check me out on Twitch too. My name is Scooby Stacks on that too. Give me support. Thanks a lot for all the views and all the likes and follow me but we continue on so let's see what happens hopefully it left off and this episode is just as good as the last on one so let's continue on so let's play Back so soon? What's the rush? Okay, okay, sit down, shut up, and pay attention. The misfit vault hunters had discovered the secret location of the Gortis project, but getting there wouldn't be easy. Hyperion had not forgotten about their renegade employees, and the native Pandoran wildlife was, uh, just getting to know them. They escaped with their lives, but not much else. Out in the wasteland, the former middle manager discovered Handsome Jack riding shotgun in his brain while having a shotgun pointed at his head. Fancy meeting you two. A precarious position, to be sure, but nothing compared to the con artist. The price on her head had attracted all kinds of thugs and gunmen. You'd think that would have been the end of her story, but hey, you never know when a polite reprogrammed killing machine will drop in and save the day. Was she bothering you? Back on the trail of the Gortis project, they found a wondrous hidden city, risen from the corpse of a ghost town. But, unfortunately, their moment of awe and victory was to be the advantage of their opponents. <laughs> Taken hostage and forced to surrender the keys to the kingdom, they had to go all in on one last gamble. This chapter of the story begins with the questionable choice to trust Handsome Jack. chose a bona fide nutcase over Fiona? Yes, he did. Uh, kind of overestimating Fiona's sanity with that statement. Being around you would make anyone nuts after a while. I'm starting to get that. I, I'm sorry, are you guys teaming up now? Because I kind of feel like you are. <laughs> Why did you choose Jack? When all of Pandoran recorded history would tell you it's a risky choice. In all honesty, I didn't trust Fiona. Yeah, that's pretty clear. Still don't, really. Also clear. But you trusted Jack. Y you mean a guy whose sole occupation isn't hustling people? Yeah, I I'm gonna go with that guy. You chose Jack, cause you're an idiot. There's no other explanation for it. suppose there's a spare for the spare. Well, if there is, I'm not changing it this time. We're close. We can walk it from here. Where the hell is here? Yeah. And why is it where we are? I'll tell you when I find what we're looking for. So, what happened next? <laughs> well, things started out fine. Mm. <laughs> Hail to the king, baby! <laughs> hey, 
Kid, what are you doing? You mean, I'm controlling the drones? Yeah, well, <laughs> with my help, but yeah. Let's get killing, Cupcake. Reese? Come on. Oh, I missed it. We have to get up there. Get us up there. Yeah. Sasha! Get us up there, Reese. Yeah, yeah, I got it. Come on, come on, let's go! Sasha, Vaughn! You made the right choice, kid. I'm really proud of you. Don't let it go to your head. Hurry up, Reese! Yeah, hurry up! I left you one, pal. He's, uh, he's a little on the dumpy side, but I, it, it seems like it would be a good fit for you. Oh. Cool. Get him, dump. Guy, I'm taking you with me for some reason. This is so cool, right? D did you guys see me? I mean, how cool I was. <laughs> what now? Calm down, Sash. Can I have your gun? No, you do not need a gun. We blow up the front door. Loaderbot can help. Ah, duh. Hey, can you help us out? Yes. Lock and safe. No kidding. Oh, buddy, are you, uh, <laughs> hands are, re for the record, not my idea.
Uh, who the hell is that? Friends of yours? Motorbot! Pull up! Thanks. Don't mention it. <sighs> you the leader of this outfit? Hey, you all right there, buddy? I've had it worse. Oh. Right, cause the... Yeah. Nope. I just landed closer to you. There she is. You remember me? Great. These jackasses. Oh, she remembers, all right. No? Oh, that is ice cold. Good on you, girl. Some nice all last right, words. that's enough. Calm down, Finch. She's the one who shot the shit out of me. Oh, yes, yeah, she did. Please, just, just let me shoot that girl in the in face. Get truck. Just You're time. being a nuisance. Me too. But, man, I didn't even... Man, Those guys you got there boys get me in are trouble. pretty useless. With your reputation, I'd figure you'd keep better company. They have their strong suits. Fashion is not one of them. Fee? Mmm. I see why you're Felix's favorite. Don't be surprised. I've known about you two for as long as you've been lifting watches. But I'm out ten million bucks cause someone turned a simple deal into a complete shit show. Someone has to pay for that. <sighs> Looks like we have a couple new contestants. This isn't good. Okay, okay, I know how it looks. Things got a little messed up, but- Shut up! I'll deal with you later. I just want to say I had nothing to do with this. Uh-huh. Who's to blame here, Fiona? I want a name. Calm down, Hugo. No! no. I just... Like, I just need her to know. She's gonna say it, it was my... You want to know who's to blame? That's... why we're all standing here. Felix. This is all Felix's fault. But he's not here, is he? That doesn't change that he's to blame. Look, I know you're super pissed, but we've got the Gordy's thing, and it is going to get us a vault that is worth way more than 10 million bucks, just like we told you. Everything is fine. We're fine. So this is what all the fuss is about. Yeah. Yeah. That's our little moneymaker. Huh? Then I guess I don't need you anymore. What? No! 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 I suppose I don't need any of you. Heads up. I thought it was a flashbang grenade. Uh, it is. That's not how it works. And that's not how it went. She put that gun in your face and you went all... Keep talking. 
the truth this time. Fine. But where was I? <laughs> you were in the middle of this. I was getting Gordas back. Not here! We gotta go! This isn't over. You're the one leaving. Looks over to me. No. It'll feel much different than this. i let you know when it happens. Tell me, are you all... Just completely stupid? Is this some sort of trick question? Cause I don't see... I am here to help you! You idiots! Oh. This is easily the most annoying contract I've ever taken. Oh, at least if it was an assassination, I'd have the pleasure of a kill at the end of it. Oh, well, I'm so sorry for the inconvenience. Who even hired you? A man named Felix. I normally don't divulge that kind of information, but he wanted you to know. He said to tell you he's sorry. What did he hire you for, exactly? Felix wanted me to pass along some knowledge, to mentor you, to help you survive. He felt you two had some untapped potential. You couldn't have told us this earlier? It's not exactly something you scream down an alley when you've got Valerie's goons running around. My work requires some discretion. Oh, discretion. When you say that, are you referring to the part where you were chasing us through Hollow Point, trying to behead us with your shield? If I wanted to behead you, it would have happened. Whoa, don't be mad we got away. We'll see how this goes. Keep an eye on her, Sasha. It's usually better not to say that stuff in front of the person you're talking about. Oh, is this part of the mentoring? I didn't know we were starting already. Ugh. Look, I know you two have been through a lot. But I assure you I'm here to help. And I don't anticipate that'll be very long, because when I feel the contract is filled, I'll be out of your lives. So let's just... get through this. Well, welcome aboard, I guess. Thank you. So, uh... is he alright? Cause that's... not normal. That's Vaughn for ya. Oh yeah, he's... he's just going through some stuff. He's harmless, <laughs> I think. That's comforting. Hey! Huh. Don't do that. Uh. Oh yeah, I think I got something. What you got? I don't know, but I, I found out there's an on button somewhere. You've been looking at that thing for like 20 minutes. Well, it's apparently very small. Startup sequence. Energy chassis required for Vault of the Traveler protocol. Loading coordinates for energy chassis. Gortis activated. Happy birthday. Hi! Wow! Hey! Really great to meet you all. I think I was expecting something different. I'm sorry if you're disappointed. Is this it? Yes, it is. You're asking because it's just too awesome, right? Too awesome to believe! Something like that. 
Oh, it was a robot this whole time! Yes, I am! That makes sense! Does that make sense? Yes, it does! Oh, cool! You got another robot! It's very nice to meet you. How is your day going? It's a mixed bag. That's great! Variety is so important! Gordis, hi. Hi! So, from what I understand, you can get us a vault. Absolutely! Now, I don't know every detail, but I was created by Atlas as a last-ditch effort to get to the riches of a vault, to get a leg up on those Hyperion guys. Well, we are still number one. Atlas had facilities all over Pandora, working on the pieces of me to get it done faster. But then, that lady made it a little more difficult to assemble by killing every Atlas employee. Well, uh, how many more pieces are there? No idea, but the next piece we need is... Uh... Oh, that away! Okay, let's do this. Great! Oh, that's a great idea. Everybody up and at Come on, Slowpoke! Time's all wasted! Uh, Gordis? Hmm? He is, um... Oh, he's... he's dead, Gordis. Oh, that's sad. No, no, he, he was a... he was a bad person, like... Really, really bad. Oh, well, good riddance then. 